A few seconds at some times determines the rest of your life. You're going to college. 17 year old Marcelino Solano has really worked hard, and now 10 colleges want him. <laughs> His father, Manuel Solano, is bursting with pride. His son will be the first person in his family to go to college. After the excitement subsides, his dad says the reality sets in. How does his family cover the costs? The best thing he can give me to me and like as a gift for the, my future is the education. Born in the U.S., his family is from Mexico. He now lives in the Bronx and he learned English in the eighth grade. Marcelino's father works in a restaurant in Astoria and his mother cleans homes. When he was um, a child, he didn't have the opportunity to, to study. All 79 seniors graduating are bilingual, all minority, first generation American teenagers who are getting accepted into college. The harsh reality is some may not be able to go. It starts with us and helping them believe in themselves so that they can understand and know that they have power. Melissa Melconian, the founder of the American Dream Charter School, says it's a critical turning point to reach that American dream, a chance to lift their families out of crushing poverty. These kids being low income, they're applying for both federal and state aid. Um, and even if they get the full Pell Grant, the full TAP Grant, they're still looking at a deficit of $13,000. The school does raise funds to help offset some of the costs. Solano's decided to go to SUNY Environmental Science and Forestry to study wildlife biology. He's excited to make his dad proud. And Solano says he will do what it takes to make it happen. And if you want to help him and other first-generation college-bound teens make their American dream happen, just go to my Facebook, Instagram, or Twitter at Monica Morales TV. In the Bronx, Monica Morales, Pix11 News.